This is a WECT Cape Fear Business Break. Hello, thanks for watching the Cape Fear Business Break. Today we are talking with Dr. Radha Pucha and Gina Wooten with Lower Cape Fear Hospice. Welcome to you both. Thank, Thank you. you for having us. Now we've been talking about National Hospice Month and uh, the ex end of life experience that Carol, your friend and coworker had. Tell us about the role you played in that. Um, well, as a hospice physician, um, as soon as we got the consult to admit her for hospice services, I did go to her house along with the admission nurse and she was in a lot of pain. Um, so right away we were able to get her pain medication started and she had a lot of nausea and anxiety and I was able to get the medication started and she really felt better by the next day and the day after. And a week later, she was able to make a trip out of town to enjoy with her friends. Wow, that's amazing. Now, what role did you play in this? I was her nurse case manager, so I was sort of the liaison um, between our team members. I would go check on her in her home, mm -hmm. and she would tell me how she was responding to the medications we were trying. And I sort of was the bridge speaking to Dr. Pucha if she was having any symptoms that weren't controlled. I would speak with her and we would sort of adjust and experiment with things until we found exactly what she needed to keep her comfortable. Wow, that's wonderful. And that you, you did this for her in her own home. I Absolutely. mean, that's amazing. Yes. She wanted to stay home as long as she could. Um, and then at the end, if she was not able to stay by herself, she was planning to move in with her sister. Mm -hmm. um, but she, had, she has fabulous sisters who were able to care for her in her home until the very end. Oh, that's wonderful. Thank you so much. Thank you. You can find out more about Lower Cape Fear Hospice by going to lcfh.org. This has been a WECT Cape Fear Business Break.